President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. told newly promoted military officials to work among the soldiers in addressing the security challenges facing the country. In his speech during the oath-taking ceremony of the newly promoted AFP generals and flag officers, President Marcos said the threats could jeopardize the peace efforts of the administration as he reminded them of the heavier responsibilities attached to the stars added to their shoulders. All that you feel are, in fact, our people's hopes. Especially now that we are at the juncture of our history where our nation faces complex security challenges. The response to which requires bold thinking, brave action, which I know you can supply in abundant amounts as befits your rank and you can summon from your previous experience. This is the landscape that confronts you now. It is the security terrain that you have to address in the remaining tours of duty of your career. The Commander-in-Chief also expressed confidence that the AFP members will remain committed to their sworn statement to protect and serve the Philippines and the Filipino people. That you will uphold the principles that made you patriots, professionals, always compliant with command, faithful to our constitution, loyal to our country, and mindful of our conscience. Before the oath-taking ceremony, PBBM met with high-ranking Philippine Air Force or PAF officials at Villamor Air Base in Pasay City. According to the Presidential Communications Office, the Air Force offered insights and recommendations to President Marcos on bolstering the country's air power capabilities to safeguard the nation against emerging security challenges, including the enhancement of capabilities for disaster response. The PAF appreciates the President's guidance and support for modernization efforts within the military, aim at enhancing the country's defense capabilities to address current challenges. Nel Maribuho, UNTV News and Rescue, we serve the people, we give glory to God.